You know what? I'm gonna break my own rule. I said I was gonna do 15 minutes. The last video was already 25 minutes. Um, I played this on my own, and I really liked it. And um, you know what? It was easy to restart from pretty much the place that I was. So we're just gonna finish this first chapter here. Um, the first episode is more final than I thought. The other episodes are like, I guess it follows different people and stuff. So I thought it was all like kind of a continuing story, but you know, w with it being a fairly you know conclusive conclusion um let's just finish this up i might have to split it into a couple videos i might put in one I, I i'll i'll figure it out when i'm done concentrate velma all right huh another noise i also really like how this game handles the um i got most of the achievements first run as far as i know i, I assume this one marks the end of the chapter one things because of the, the the next one is like a painting one. So it's not all it's not all falling Vilma, it's not all but with music, which is interesting. But um the noise is coming from in here. Uh, but one thing I really appreciate is that once you're finished, um it kinda does that telltale games thing where it tells you who, who you know, who made which choices and stuff. Um and then you can go back and redo the other choice. And it gives you it shows you kind of which choices were the major ones, which um I really, I really appreciate that. I, I like these kind of games in theory, but I find if I have to replay a whole, like, even if it's fairly short, you know, a few hours, like a couple hours even, and like I have to, you know, manually pick each choice and like, I gotta Google a guide, blah, blah, blah. It's just, ugh. But if I can just go back and be like, all right, I wanna see what happens if you do this different, and I can just do that, I appreciate that, and that's, that's what I'm doing. Well, actually, I'm gonna redo pretty much what I did. Where could he have hidden a key? Maybe the flower pot outside. And I think the major points, the major, um, well, we'll get to it when we saw to it. I, I was um, kind of right about the whole Arthur thing. Arthur, we, we get some, you'll, you'll see, you'll see. This just looks so peaceful and nice. I mean, the, 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 the spooky storm is going to be pretty bad, but um, this is a long storm, by the way. It's been, <laughs> it's been like two days. It's still raining, it's still like ominous black clouds. Why did Arthur leave flowers on the porch? There's a key! I love if you just <laughs> magically thinks, hmm, let's let's check out the um You can't tell the thing. Oh! Something shimmers between the trees. You have to look very closely to see it. You can tell it's there. A melody hidden between the layers of music. I like the little discovery of the pieces of music. Far from everything familiar, separated by stone as old as the world itself. She is alone. Powerful harmony, separating the melodies. Music. Well, let's go fix that pocket watch, I guess. Or whatever's ticking. It's pointless. It was a pocket watch. <laughs> Sorry, I've soiled it. Soiled it. Soiled it. Soiled it! Ticks of the old watch shatter in her imagination. Or, or, hear me out here, turn the watch off, pull out the battery, you know? Well, I guess battery. <laughs> that old pocket watch. Arthur must have had a reason to lock this letter away. Let's not invade on his pride, let's totally do it. My beloved Arthur, I can hardly wait to see you again. Memory of your last visit still hangs in the air, like a note that, after the orchestra has already finished, lingers on. Barf! Barf! It fills me with dreams, feelings, longings for you! Oh! Oh, goodness. Laying it on thick, huh, honey? Sometimes I want to get away from Vienna. I want to travel with you across Europe and farther. With every year one senses what was fine in this city. What? I, I read that wrong. What was once worthwhile and grand now ebbing away. The voices all sound the same these days. Just echoes from better times long past. Vienna was losing itself. The city, its people, they don't care. They, don't, they see it. They see to it that things keep on as they are. Instead of doing something about it. It's actually pretty hard to read things as they're appearing. Um, especially when it's like word by word, like letter by letter. This is, <laughs> I know I stumble at all, but trust me. Just try doing it yourself. I want to, don't want to stay by and watch. 
I hear Berlin is the future, full of beauty and hope. Let's go there sometime. What do you think? Please tell me soon. Yours, Greta. Another one? Arthur. Arthur, you, 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 goddamn pig. Sketches. Ugh. Several figures drawn in a chaotic style. I like the one on the on the right. He's like, mm, yes, I will eat one chip. Mm. Many facets of the same person. Ah, yes, the three genders: dancing, idle, and eat hot chip and lie. Which are you? A melody formed of multiple facets. Explain to me your facets. Explain your facets in the comments, children. I can barely keep my eyes. <laughs> She looks so agonizingly tired. Just that, just that little pixel change, and she yearns for death. Um, I mean, we don't have a lot of time. We have, I thought we had a week, but we have like two more days. Weeks are weeks are like five days long, right? Yes. I mean, work weeks, but our eyelids become heavier and heavier. In the haze of fatigue, the nose of her music becomes blurred quietly. New ones emerge. This is a bad idea, by the way. I just thought it was dramatic and fitting. Don't. <laughs> if you need to sleep, just sleep. You'll you'll work better with some sleep. But I thought it vibed well with the tortured artist kind of crap. You know, sometimes you gotta ham it, ham it up, huh? Who's who's ringing the damn phone? Hello, Leos. Good evening, Vilma. It is me, Aza Vilma. What, what do you want? Funny you should ask me that. What, what do you mean? Why do you always try to make other people happy? But, but, I, but I don't. So what do you want? Okay, Mr. Morden. What do you want? I want to be with Arthur. I want to be successful. I want to go home. <laughs> I just want to go home. No, no, not Arthur. I want to be successful. I want to be somebody. Ah, that's more like it. At last, we're talking about what you want. I believe you can be successful, but what are you going to do to achieve that success? I've never had one of these dramatic, like, internally revealing dreams where I, like, talk about myself and crap. I just dream about, honestly, like, video game things and, like, stupid school dreams. I still have stupid school dreams, even though I didn't have problems in school. <laughs> well, not really. I mean, a few occasionally, but like, ugh. Anyway. I will write music. I can finish this piece. Yeah, just, just keep it, keep it focused. We're just gonna finish this piece. Good. You'd better get back to work then. Vienna deserves to hear your music. <laughs> Shooting laser eyes at each other. Yes. Also, I feel like a jerk to Leos. I, I wanna... I was gonna redo and, like, pick up the phone, but I figured, you know what? We'll just do... We'll continue on the, the path that I took. Don't wanna change it up too much. The storm. It's here. Oh, no, 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 no. You know what? I'll finally get to enjoy, like, big storms again once they happen, because it's finally stopped leaking into my goddamn house and rotting the wood in this stupid building. But some construction's finally going on. I can't write like this. Storm, the thunder, the lightning. Can I block them out? Go away. No. It doesn't work this time. I can't think clearly. I can't let my fears control me. I can't block them out. I have to try. Maybe I won't be able to hear the music anymore? Fear and angst. We're gonna let the voices stay. I was actually really surprised. I, d I tried this both ways, actually. Most people keep the voices, which really surprised me. Um, I, I, I screwed around, and I tried to, like, find things, and I just gave up, and I stopped the voices, and, like, only 18% of people did that. Um, I don't know if it's just a factor of time, but there will eventually be an event that occurs. There we go. No, it doesn't work this time. I will drown in the storm. Arthur will never talk to me again. I'll have to leave Vienna. The storms are on top of me. 
something will happen. I, I, I hate moments like this in games. Uh, honestly. It's not a huge deal. It doesn't ruin the rest of the game for me, but... If I was not explicitly told there was another thing to do here, um, I would have thought what I did was the only way. And it's also why I'm completely stunned that the majority, the great majority of people, did not do what I did. Can I take the telephone yet? I, I think it's just a matter of waiting. I'm just gonna wait a minute. So how was your day? I ordered a bunch of food. To be fair, it was it's supposed to last like three or four days. I just wanted to save on delivery and I had a good coupon. Um, I, I want, every time I like want to pig out and I get like a bunch of good food, I, I can't, I just like get hungry, I get full immediately. And I always feel like on a regular day that I eat too fast, so I eat too much. So I've been trying to eat more slowly, but this time, <laughs> I was like, you know what? It's a boring Sunday. I'm in a crappy mood. I'm gonna eat a bunch of food and I'm gonna enjoy myself. And I did enjoy myself, but I could not eat like, I ate like half of what I expected to. But I'm getting pretty good at reheating pizza and stuff. Uh, I swear something happens. I, <laughs> there must be some exact specific thing I had to do. I could have swore that you just I'm, I'm serious that something happens. Why is it like this? Is he not gonna call? Go away. No, it doesn't work this time. Maybe... You know what? I think that maybe this depends on an earlier decision, and the only way was, in fact... So we're gonna see the decisions. Um... So they wanna be successful. Uh... Pushing through to sleep. Alright, this is the decision. Um... I think the majority of people did not tell Leos. I don't think the majority of people hung up on Leos. And I think... Okay. That's interesting. So the, the be there, please be there. So he, ah, that's it. Okay, um, this option gets canceled out because I hung up on Leos. But when I go to choose, when I pick the decision, it it preassumes that I've already, you know, I was nice to Leos. So sorry, Leos. I I, I was I was a jerk, but um, I, I guess that makes sense. But and that's kind of interesting, actually. Um. That you go straight to the decision points, even with all of the preconditions, like, automatically assumed. Um, that, that's kind of nice of the game. Because, again, I hate the thing where, like, I have to replay a whole game just to see the specific branching paths. And I love when, um, some visual novel games, Ren Pi is particularly good at it. Um, it'll let you skip all the way straight to whatever decision branch. And you can see, you know, you can automatically skip all the stuff you've already seen. That is, that's great for me. Because I, I just want to see what's new. I don't want to redo everything. I don't want to see, like, oh, you know. If you make this, these 16 choices, um, the dog in the background is a Pomeranian instead of uh, a Labradoodle. And, you know, it's very important to the story. And you see, you have, you, you have real outcomes in the slideshow ending. Shout out to New Vegas. Velma, is that you? Oh god, I'm so glad you're here. Calm down, calm down, what is it? It's all too much. What was that? Thunder. Real thunder this time, not my stomach. Haha. <laughs> the storm's here. I'm so afraid. Thunder, ah. Don't worry, it'll be alright. Just, just focus on my voice. Your, yes, your voice. Can you hear me? Yes, you're desperately not whispering. You're right, I'm yelling! What does my voice sound like? Why do you care? <laughs> Old? <laughs> mean! What do you, why do you care? I do, I do. Stressed? Yes, I guess you're right. I'm still here. <laughs> it seems so mean. Why would I call him calm old? You are not the whisperer at the top of the well. Who? I had a dream I was drowning in a well. Someone came. They ran away. Not me. I would have helped you. I know. That wasn't my father, either. He wouldn't abandon me. Arthur was never mine. Oh, God. It was... 
It was me! <laughs> I was running away from myself. Very literally, apparently. I was running away from my composition. It was an important dream. What is that doctor's name in Vienna? Freud? Exactly! With approve of your interpretations, I think, yes! Yes. Yeah, you would. Do you remember you tried to talk me about out of calling Nicole? <laughs> we didn't. We actually didn't see that part. Um, I did. I'm a stubborn old check. <laughs> He's checked. Where did he? Did he tell us where he's from? I mean, he's checked me, obviously, but I, I don't. Well, we we skipped a whole dialogue with him. That's why we're confused. But what'd she say? She was overjoyed. He said I should visit her as soon as possible. Do you believe it? I'm glad. Simply had to call her. The silence that followed her last call. As soon as your voice was gone. I was reminded of how lonely I really am. Aww. You still lonely? Not anymore. Not when I'm talking to you. I'm glad I can talk to you. I don't I don't know any <laughs> if if there's like I'm sure there's some regional differences between, you know, a Czech accent and a Russian accent. I'm just gonna go with the hammy Russian one. It's all I can do. It's all I can do. It's a great invention, the telephone. <laughs> I, I guess the novelty when you don't have computers and like text ways to like not r interrupt each other's lives, but still communicate. That's nice. <laughs> you still there? Yes, yeah, still here. What are you doing? <laughs> Creepy. I'm writing music. What about that storm? Still here, too. No longer disturbs you? No. Wonderful. I've been in a big recording mood. I got, I got, <laughs> I got super pissed off and I didn't want to deal with people. I guess I got that, I got in a bit of a, you know, creative mood. I don't know. I can vision the song now. The song of courage. It's being a creative though. I have to edit like 10 videos now. Ah, I let it get away from me. I have a bunch of stuff already uploaded. So I didn't really want to do the edits, but now I got to edit. Of being yourself and facing the shadows. May I hear it? I'll play it for you on my violin. <gasps> Ghost violin! But who was phone? <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. Wonderful! No, I'm not done. But soon. Until soon then. Farewell, Vilma. Farewell, my friend. Can you imagine four numbers? The. the <laughs> I think uh, things mostly operated by like um, switching centers. Like you called in to the operator and you told them who to call, and they like literally switched the lines. Um, look it up. It's it's crazy. Still a lot to write. Sensors, rhythms, my bag, my old violin. Despite its battered appearance, still has the most beautiful tone. Flames, rhythms already in my composition. Ah, raindrops. That's good. My old pocket watch. Correct it. Are we gonna improvise the creepy, weird people? Oh, people holding their breath, their eyes sparking with excitement. Move away and come closer. She hears their footsteps and the clinking glasses in their hands. Senses their glances. Everything comes together. A harmony engulfing the melody, giving it strength. How can I? Yes, like this. This is why I, I, I usually lately I try to look up how long a game is before I record it, because like I need to know. All right, if it's ten hours, I'm just gonna do fifteen minutes. If it's like one hour, or better yet, like half an hour, I can probably do the whole thing. Uh, I do. I hate to leave so many incomplete let's plays. More like quick looks. I I usually go for the quick look kind of thing anymore. Um, but uh, <laughs> I just don't have the kind of time to dedicate to everything. Especially with, you know, usually the first video gets like more than double. Um, often way more than double the views of the rest of the stuff. And, yeah. Or will I get something to write on? Well... I up Arthur's composition is clean. Ah, Arthur's a prick. He's got his little sex cabin in the woods for his little student prodigies. Freaking gross. Wait, waste his paper. Come on. Just look at it. 
Her music lifts her mood. It's my best work so far. Melodies flow through her mind. I am kind of confused though, because I figured like a major choice would be like doting on Arthur and stuff, and there are several options we can like, in, you know, imply that she's like really feeling for Arthur. Um, but screw Arthur, we're going for Leos. Leos is pretty cool. The best listener to, from Vienna to Kermau. So this is the lion song. Also, the first time I went through, I did not get that, you know, phone call. Um, I could only, um, you know, talk to my voices. So the, the only options were Otto and Arthur, so that's interesting. I, I'm sure there are little bits in different dialogue, um, different just from, like, the small minor things, not just the major decisions. But, um... Auditorium is packed. Compositions by Schoenberg, Mahler, and others who have already been played. The mood is tense. Expectant. Seems as if the whole city of Vienna is here. But now is not the time to be nervous. You gotta love that severed hand pointer. The lion song. Sounds of melodies free themselves from the instruments. Whirl in a flaming dance above the audience. <laughs> the pretentious music part of things, like, I, I, I appreciate it enough. Uh, expand with wide and distant perspectives. But I, I like the personal element to this. That's, that's what drew me in more than the, um, the whole the music protege thing doesn't really mean a lot to me. Form pictures of familiar faces and places. I can appreciate the creative struggle. Quiet to a calm, bright spark. But... I, I am gl glad that we kind of get to turn away from Arthur. Branch, split and spread. I don't have enough good enough music ear for music to know if the song is different. I assume the song is different depending on your choices. And seem far away, all of a sudden, muffled as if heard through falling snow. It's music. I think it's different. I would assume that it's different than burning with the desire to break free. I want to break free. Ah, oh, yes, the shadow people applaud terrifyingly and slowly. Cleave to facets, clean and sharp edged. This is much too long for 15 minutes, but I will just do two 25 minute videos, I guess. Persisting, yet changing from moment to moment. <laughs> you gotta love that X, but exactly the opposite of X sentiment. Now peaceful like a warm voice from far away. <laughs> we know what that was referring to. So yeah, I'm sure all these little bits and parts of the music correspond to your choices and stuff. Comforting. Human music. I like it. Memories. So yeah, I definitely think I'll be checking out the other episodes of this. I'm not sure I'll do videos on them. Um, I'll see what you guys think. I'll see what, what we're thinking from the comments. Um, probably how many views on the video, to be totally honest. Um, a reminder, this one this one is free, actually. The, um, the other episodes you buy, it's like a... It's like a real free-to-play thing. Like, what do you... What would you call that? I hate that free to play is like not actually free to play. Fading f false sense of someday. That's a little depressing, but. You got that Nintendo rim lighting. Oh, beautiful. Such a lovely melody. Oh! As the curtain falls, Wilma leaves the stage and disappears behind countless musicians. There was, their reactions to the music was a little bit more tepid. Uh, not that tepid, but there was some, hmm, you know. Oh yeah, and here's the thing I was talking about. It's, uh, you're, you're dealing with a painter next time, so that's neat. Chrono Trigger looking ass. Visit, visit, visit the Viennese art scene. Ah, oh, yes. As a young artist with a unique gift. I see people differently. The lion 
it, so... There's some definite cliches I'm already seeing, you know. There were some cliches of this one, you know, the, the prodigy, the teacher. Um, I thought it was interesting, though. And it didn't quite resolve as I was expecting. I, I also think this is cute. The, the credits is kind of like a little... thing. Molecule Engine. Huh. I haven't heard of that. Nipumi Games. Chris Scoop. Stephen Serb. Berger Einger. Oh. You all made a pretty cool game. Ico Partners. You, you, yeah, I, I know you because you emailed me the game. Um, feels weird of all things. I, I tend to be pretty familiar with uh, PR just because I get, you know, I get emailed by those people now. 22% said they wanted to be successful. Ah, Parker. I hope I hope the majority didn't go for the... I guess there was three choices that time. But going for Arthur, come on. That's right, Parker. Well. If you didn't talk about Nicole to Leos. I didn't talk to Leos at all. <laughs> but that's interesting. Um, that was the Lion Song? Um, I really enjoyed that. Like I said, um, I'll probably enjoy the others on my own. I don't know if I'll do videos. See, when I first saw this, I thought this was like, oh, it's young Vilma, it's young Arthur, and, you know, then it's older Arthur. But no, I guess, these are totally do, new people, I, I guess. New! Park, the Parker alarm is going off. It's time to pet Parker. So, <laughs> thanks for watching, everybody. Let me know what you thought of the game in the comments. I will see you later. All right, gamers, remember to like, subscribe, and smash that bell, frog. What are you doing in my house? I, I, I will just get out.